What's up world, Summit Fitness here. I'm a little bit out of breath because of my new invention and another IMW series, Intelligent Man Workouts, where I give you the low budget equipment that produces high effective results. Today, I only spent about uh, 20 bucks for this bucket. It was the bucket was $7, the tape was about like three. This rope over here was actually uh, like four or five and the carabiner was two. And uh, essentially I'm doing uh, bucket circles here. So this is an old kind of gymnastic S type of movement. So what you see here is pretty much just a whole bunch of duct tape that's rolled up here. Um, about literally like 12 times over, maybe 18 I wanna say. And then the clip here is attached to this hoop. As you see right there, this is what is allowing me to kind of like have this rotation effect. And then more importantly, I have it attached to my gymnastic ring, which I've always had for a while, and a towel right there, so that it has a smooth groove to spin around. Uh, essentially, this is, a, this is one of the best ab workouts you can do. Um, if you are interested in uh, um, further enhancing your calisthenics and body weight career, so to speak. So now let's, uh, let's put this into action and I'll explain a little bit more on uh, the making of this tool. Light work, light work. Oh. Yo. <laughs> so with this movement here, note the uh, positioning. The, actually, the right way to do this is to continuously have the body face forward and not kind of spin around um, in its entirety. So I get it right for the first few reps, but then my whole entire body changes. So I'm working on this, but I'm having fun in the process of uh, being horrible at it at the same time. So, and on top of it, I'm really enjoying the bucket circles as it's one of those just, just overall global core exercises that really lends to the benefits of you know, body weight training. So, much like with any and all skills, you gotta practice. Practice makes perfect, and there's a you know a couple of things that, of course, you can um, use to help you. And um, find those things. A couple of gym gymnasts, what they do is they use um, visual points of contact, where they'll use chalk on the floor, and uh, like they'll draw X's, and make sure that their hands are usually always touching those points of contact where they have their body go around that point of contact, but. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll show you some more descriptions of that type of stuff later. Peace.